Hello, this is Gigo Crochet. In this video tutorial, we will learn how to uh, make this uh, stitch, the basket weave stitch. It's uh, a very uh, nice and uh, simple stitch to work. Uh, this uh, st uh, the um, stitch I'm doing is uh, four by four. So uh, to chain, we have uh, to multiply uh, the fours plus two chains at the end. So if you want to do, uh, let's say, uh, 40 uh, chains, multiple of four, uh, you, you will add uh, two at the end. For the purpose of this tutorial, I will be using, uh, I will uh, chain 28 plus two, so it will be 30 uh, chains. I hope you will enjoy this tutorial. Please subscribe for other videos update. Thank you. Okay, we have uh, chained multiple of fours. Uh, and plus uh, two chains at the last, so it is uh, 30 chains, 28 plus two, 30 chains. To begin, we will skip uh, the next uh, three uh, chains, and then we will double crochet in the fourth. Double crochet like this. And we will do two more in next chain. Uh, next two chains so this is one and two like this okay now we will continue doing uh, double crochets uh, along the row until we reach the end of the row and to start the second row. So we will start doing this like this. Okay, continue doing this pattern until you reach the end of the row and I will meet you there. Okay, we have reached the end of uh, row uh, one. We still have uh, two double crochets to do in last two chains like this. One, two. Okay. We have uh, ended round, uh, sorry, uh, row one, and now we will start row two and our pattern. So we will chain three and then turn our work like this. Now what we will do, we will uh, uh, do a stitch called uh, front uh, post, double crochet. To do this, we will uh, yarn over and then insert our hook from behind the double crochet from previous row and then we will get a uh, loop, yarn over and then through two loops, yarn over and crochet through the last Two loops like this. We will do this uh, two times uh, more. So we will have a uh, front post double crochet, pull through two, pull through two. Now we uh, will do the last uh, one here by doing a front post double crochet, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through two like this. Okay, now at the next four double crochets, we will do back post double crochets in the four double crochet from previous rounds. This will uh, be done by yarning over and then we will go from behind the double crochet and then yarn over and pull through a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two like this. Okay, like this. Now, we will do three more. So we will yarn over, go from behind our work and then through the back, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over and pull through two. Okay, this is the second. Now we will ha do the third one, yarn over from back, Post like this, pull up a loop, 
yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two and the last back post double crochet like this yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two okay like this now we will uh, do uh, four uh, front post double crochet in the next four double crochets we will do this like this and we will pull up a loop through two pull through two like this the second one like this pull up a loop pull through two and pull through two now the third one here yarn over go from behind the front post uh, the uh, double uh, crochet a front post like this yarn over pull through two yarn over and pull through two the last one yarn over work a front post like this yarn over pull through two and yarn over pull through two like this okay now we will uh, do the uh, back post here I will do this once and like this from behind pull up a loop yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two again from behind yarn over pull through two and yarn over pull through two again from behind like this yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two and the last one the back the last back post uh, double crochet yarn over pull through two and yarn over pull through two and we will start the front post the four front post keep doing this pattern until you reach the end of this round uh, this row and i will meet you there okay we have reached the end of uh, row two we still have two uh, double uh, crochet front post uh, at the last uh, two double crochets here so we will work the first one like this and the last front post double crochet like this okay okay now we will begin row three we will uh, chain three like this and then we will turn our work now the pattern as we can see there is a uh, back post and front post what we will do each back post we will work a back post double crochet and for the front post we will work front post so the same as what we see for this we have back posts here so we will do a back post like this and now we will do the second back post and the third back post now the total back posts are four from the beginning chain three here now we will continue the pattern now we have front posts here so we will work four front post and next four front posts like this okay now we will uh, begin the back post in the next four back post we will continue doing this pattern until we reach the end of this round and i will meet you there okay we have reached the end of row three we still have uh, two back posts to uh, work like this and the last back post like this okay now we will begin round four chain three and then turn your work like this again we will do exactly what we did in row three so all each uh, uh, front post we will work a front post double crochet and each back post we will work back post double crochet like this until we reach the end of the row ok 
okay now uh, back post from behind like this and we will continue doing this pattern until we reach the end of row 4 and I will meet you there Okay, we have reached the end of row 4, we still have two front posts to do like this and the last two front posts, double crochets. Now the last front post, like this. Okay, now we will begin round uh, our uh, row 5, we will chain 3 and then we will turn our work like this. Again, we will... Uh, do exactly what we did in row four so all the back posts uh double crochet we will work back posts and for the front post we will work front post on top so we will uh, do this and uh, keep doing this pattern until you reach the uh, end of row five and i will meet you there Okay, we have reached the end of round uh, five. We still have two back posts to work like this. This is one and the last back post to end row five. Okay, now uh, the pattern uh, starts to appear uh, now if you have if you count uh, the rows here you would have one two three four that means we need now to reverse our pattern so all um, the back post uh, double crochet we will work on them front post and the front post we will work on them back post I will do now row six and of course we will repeat row from one to five so we will uh, do uh, row six now. So this is one, two, three, and we will turn our work. Now this, this here is a front post. So to uh, start the basket weave uh, stitch or a pattern, we will work a f uh, back post on top of the front post like this. Okay, and the second like this and the third and we reach the next four back posts so we work on top of them front posts like this like this <clears throat> okay now we will work a, uh, a back post on next uh, on top of next uh, four front post. We will keep uh, doing this pattern until we reach the end of row six, and I will meet you there. Okay. We have reached the end of row 6, we still have uh, two back posts on top of uh, next two uh, front posts like this to end the row 1 and the last back post like this and 2, okay? As you can see the pattern starting to uh, appear here. Now we will uh, start working uh, row seven. One, two, three, and we will turn. And again, we will uh, do what we did in row three. So all on top of the front post, we will work front post, and on top of the back post, we will work back post until we reach the end of uh, uh, the uh, row, like this. And I will meet you at the end.
Okay, we have reached the end of uh, row seven. We still have uh, two front rows to work like this. And the last front post like this. Okay, now we will begin row eight. We will chain three and turn our work and again we will repeat the pattern as we did in row uh, seven. Uh, all the uh, back posts uh, uh, stitches will uh, we will work on top of them back posts and the front post we will work front posts on top of it. So and we will continue do, uh, doing this pattern until we reach the end of uh, row 8 and I will meet you there like this. This is front post. Okay. Okay, continue doing this pattern and I will meet you at the end of the row. Okay, we have reached the end of row uh, 8. We still have two back posts to work on top of the back post from previous round, like this. Okay. Okay, now we will start uh, row 9. We chain 3 and then we turn our work. And again, we will repeat what we did in row 8. So on top of uh, the front post, we will work a front post. And on top of the back post, we will work a back post until we reach the end of uh, row uh, 9, which will be the last row in this set to begin the uh, reverse uh, pattern and uh, keep doing this and until you reach the end of row and i will meet you there okay we have reached the end of row nine we still have two front posts to work like this okay like this. Now if you count the rows here, one, two, three, four, that means now we will reverse our work and repeat the uh, rows, four rows. I will do this, uh, the first one row, so we will chain three, like this. And now for each uh, back post, we will work front, on top of uh, each back post, we will work front post like this okay and the third one like this okay now each front post we will work back post on top of it like this to reverse our work and for the basket weave stitch to uh, form. Okay, like this. So now we are reversing our work and we will keep uh, doing uh, this pattern until we reach the end of row and I will meet you there. Okay, we have reached the end of round uh, 10. We still have to work a uh, front post on top of the back post from the previous round to reverse our pattern. And the last one like this. And we will begin round 11. Now, uh, round 11, 12 and 13, it will be the same as uh, previously worked here. So on top of each uh, uh, front post we will work uh, a front post and on top of the uh, back post we will work a back post here is a back post so what we will do we will work back post 
and until we reach the uh, end of uh, round uh, 14 or 13 sorry and then we will reverse our work and start uh, the reverse pattern to uh, form the basket uh, weave stitch of course continue doing uh, this until you reach the desired uh, length that you want and i hope you enjoyed this tutorial please subscribe for other videos update and thank you for watching